there are two electron configurations that are a little bit irregular that you need to be aware of. Um, they are chromium and copper. If you consider each one of them and what they should be, then we can explain what they actually are. So for example, chromium, I'm gonna use the noble gas shortcut, is argon 4s23d4, you would think. But what happens here instead is one of the electrons from this subshell gets sent to that subshell because there's an, an enhanced stability with a half full or completely full D subshell. So as a result, this electron configuration becomes argon 4s1, 3d5. If I wanted to consider copper, I'm gonna find a similar sort of pattern. So writing the electron configuration of what I think it should be for copper, argon 4s2, 3d9, based on its position on the periodic table. But again, the same sort of thing happens. One of these gets promoted to there, and instead we have 4s1, 3d10. Again, the reasoning is because there's an enhanced stability with a half full or completely full D subshell.